Hey everybody, this is Melvin with Tech Running 24-7. And in today's video, we want to show you how to add email or multiple email accounts to your iPhone 14. Now this technique will apply to your all iPhone 14s, be, be it the regular 14, the Plus, Pro or for Pro Max. So if we reach over and grab our device here, we'll be using our iPhone 14 Pro Max as an example. So the first thing we want to do is locate our email icon and this would be our email icon here we use that because you can put anything under that and what we mean is you can put email from different companies like gmail or yahoo or even something like at&t under that as opposed to if we open this folder this one icon here says gmail or you can put under the gmail email icon is gmail only so like we said this particular icon would be better to use so once we open it you see we have one account in here which is iCloud and iCloud was automatically set up when we set the phone up by putting our Apple ID into it so we're gonna close it up real quick first thing we need to do to add an email address to our device is go to our settings so we're going to tap on those settings, and once the settings is open, we want to scroll down to where we see mail. And so we're going to tap on mail, open it up, and if you look here, it says accounts. It says one account. And so what we want to do is add another account. So we're going to hit, go to right here where it says add account, tap on that, and again, like we said, you can put different company, e different companies email in there. So we're going to go with Google. So once we tap on Google, we go to the screen where it says to sign into uh, Google email. So it says put your email or phone number. So we're going to put our email into it and uh, get our keyboard up. And we're going to put our email address into it here. And once we have our email address in there, we hit done and hit next. And then it's going to ask us for our password. And so after you get your password in, hit done. And once you hit done, then it says next. After you hit next, it's generating your email account. Then it puts you to this next screen to where you can turn on different things. Of course, you got your email on. You can turn on to where you can save contacts under that email, calendar, and notes. So we're going to just uh, leave on, we're going to turn on notes and calendar. Then hit save. And then once you hit save, it has created an email account here. It says Gmail. And so what you want to do too is go back to that real quick. And you want to uh, put the name of the account in there in case you have multiple accounts. And so we're going to go here. And then right down here where it says uh, description of Gmail. We're going to just put run in 247. Are you going to back that up? I'm sorry. Back that out. And then put R U N I N 247. And a little later on in the video, you'll see exactly why. Because if you have multiple email accounts, you can tell which one is which. So you hit done. And then go back to accounts. And now you see it says iCloud. And now it says run in 247. And so that's the additional email account that uh, you set up. And so to check it, we can come out of here like so, go back to a home screen. And now if you look at the email, now it says a large number of email, excuse me. If you open and hit it, you'll see uh, the email accounts, uh, iCloud, and then it has the other one running 24-7 and the amount of email in it. And so you can hit that to open it up to access your email accounts. And so, like we said, and this you can see now from the mailbox where it says iCloud and then your second account. And so if you wanted to look at all of them at once, you can hit all email boxes. And you can see everything uh, from each account or you can hit email mailboxes. And go into each one separately. And so what we're going to do now is going to close it out. We're going to go back into our settings. And uh, like we said, 
if we go back all the way back to the beginning of the settings, if you look at the count now, it says two. And those two are the iCloud and this other one running 24-7. And so if we want to add a third email account, we can hit add account again. And this one's going to be a Google uh, email again. So we're going to hit that Google. And now it's asking for the email accounts email address and so we're going to put that in real quick hit our keyboard and then type it in real quick now after you have your email in there hit done and then hit next then it's going to ask you for your password and so after you get your password in hit next and it's generating that email account and again to that of course it has green for the email then you can turn on either the contacts calendar or notes and so on this one let's just leave it as calendar in the email then hit save and now it's added another account and so now it says iCloud it says Gmail and then it says run it 20, 24 7 and so like we said we want to go back here to where it says Gmail and we're going to name it and so the account is called Forever Southwestern and so if we tap on that We'll go to this next screen. We'll go down to where it says description. It just says Gmail. So we will put the we want to put the name of the account in there. And so we're gonna put that in real quick. Make sure you got your spelling right. Hit done. And then if we were to come back out and hit accounts, you will see now it shows iCloud Forever Southwestern and running 24-7. Then we hit mail again. We're gonna come all the way out. And then if we look at our mailbox, our mailbox has grown again. I know that's an outrageous amount of email, but if we were to tap on that to open it, you can see it says all mailboxes. You can look at all of them at once, or you can look at the iCloud, running 24-7, or Forever Southwestern. So you, like I said, you can hit that to look at everything, close it up, or go into iCloud, and uh, hit your inbox. Come out of that and as it shows inbox here you can also scroll up to hit go to running 24 7 shows the stuff in there and if you scroll even further down forever southwest forever southwestern you can see that there so that's it for our video for today how to set up an email account or multiple email accounts on your iPhone 14 so hopefully we shared something that you can use and something that was beneficial. If so, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and hit the uh, like button. And don't forget to hit the uh, bell icon too so you can be notified of new content as soon as we release it. And again, this is Melvin with Tech Running 24-7, bringing you technology that's on the move. Thanks.